Hey there and welcome to this Timeline Bypass tutorial. In this video I will show you how to creatively use Timeline Animation together with the Effect Bypass button. Let's go! If you have watched our Effect Bypass tutorial, you know that we can bypass effects like this. Cool! But did you know you can Timeline Animate this button? To do so, right click the Bypass button and select Timeline. A new bypass parameter will show up in the effect and you are ready to start playing. The dark area of the timeline is off. The lighter area is on. By moving the in and out points around we can create custom timings. But when you say time all I hear is BPM sync that boy up. So let's do that next. Synchronizing the bypass to a beat can be a very powerful look. To do this right click the bypass button and select BPM sync. For a quick and easy look, simply set the duration to one beat. I find this to work very well with effects that are harsh, like shift glitch, distortion and displace. For a more advanced approach, you can introduce an envelope into the mix. I'll set the beat to 4 so we have something to work with. While editing the envelope, low is on, high is off. For this example, we'll say that I only want the effect applied to the first beat of each bar. My envelope would look something like this. And I think that works pretty well. And with that, I'll wrap up this tutorial. Drop your questions in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next one.